Good afternoon and salam, Ibu Petiwiku. The Consultative Committee on Malaysia Agreement 1963, MA63, will hold a meeting on Thursday to discuss measures to restore Sarawak's right under the MA63. State International Trade and E-Commerce Minister Datuk Sri Wong Sun Ko said, Chief Minister Datuk Patinggi Abang Johari Tun Openg will chair the meeting. He said Sarawak was aware that PH soon after taking over the helm of the federal government after the 14th general election promised to restore Sarawak's right and recognize Sarawak as one of the components of the Federation of Malaysia. Wong, who is also the second finance minister, said Sarawak was also affected by the current economic recession, which is expected to continue until 2020. He said this at the 2019 New Year's Eve celebration at Dataran Tun Tuanku Haji Bujang Sibu. Malaysia will require three years to restore its fiscal health and take its position as the most promising emerging economy to achieve high income status. Finance Minister Lim Guan Eng noted that Bloomberg had already placed Malaysia at number one among the top 20 emerging economies in the world. Despite the need to clean up the financial mess caused by the previous government, all three international credit rating agencies maintain the country's ratings. He said the Pakatan Harapan PH government, under the firm and reform-minded leadership of Prime Minister Tun Dr. Mahathir Mohamad, had notched up some clear successes. He added that 2019 would be a better year for Malaysia if the people stay together for a brighter future for their children. He said this in the AP's 2019 New Year's message in his capacity as the party secretary general and MP for Bagan. And that's all for me. I'm Ms. Reni for TV Sarawak. Anytime, anywhere.